Once again, this is Tukminer Laring Kumataya. Welcome back to our channel. In this video, we will learn regarding about the tow boot charger of our diesel generator, which is one of the critical parts of this equipment, parts of the machinery commonly used and in the vessel. So, makita natin ang ating diesel engine ay ang ating model ay Jersen. Meron din tayong mga Nijata, Dayatso, at saka iba pa ng model. So, ang ating turbo charger ay nakita dito, no? Ito ay isa sa mga part ng turbo charger. Ino ito ay tinatawag na compressor assembly. Tapos ang nakita niyong screen dyan ay filter kung saan dyan pumapasok yung hangin, no? Tapos yan, papasok niya, ay makita niyo dito sa ilalim, yan ay tawag na enter cooler, no? Kailangan niya pala, dapat niya pala may yun yung hangin bago i-introduce sa combustion chamber together with the fuel oil. So, ang purpose ng turbo charger ng compressor ay kailangan niya itinatawag na for increase pressure, to boost the pressure para tumaas yung RPM pa rin ng ating makina. So, papasok dito ng hangin, papasok dito ng air cooler, papasok din siya sa intake manifold. Kung tatlong silindro, tatlo din ang kanyang papasukin or before starting in it, dyan yung malaman pag pinaikot nyo ang compressor tank na hindi umikot ay tumigas, ibig sabihin, hindi aandar ang inyong makina. So, bago nyan, hindi lang pala ang pag-check ng ating lobo well sum tank o pag-check sa ibang parameters dapat pala na-checkin din natin ang fuel oil ng turbo charger no? sa dito level gates so nakita nyo to, may plug yan dyan sinusupply yung oil pagkulang, pero pag ikaw nag-change oil, ito naman ay binubuksan no? so take note dapat na may specified oil kayo na gagamitin dyan, kasi pag ang ibang oil na nilagay nyo, may tendency na masira ang ating turbo charger So, ganun ang principles, no? So, binanggit ko na na kailangan pumasok itong hangin at pagpunta ng enter cooler. Pag pinalmig niya ang hangin, pumasok ulit ng intake manifold at doon sila makikita ng fuel oil. At tapos nga, once na umandar, makikita niya dito sa pressure gauge, no? Halimbawa, meron itong, itong isang pressure gauge. Pag tumaas to, ibig sabihin, ang kanyang poster air, no? Mataas. Ibig sabihin, maganda at malinis ang inyong turbo charger. Pero pag bumagsak siya, ibig sabihin, no, kailangan nyo na napalitan ang filter, kailangan nyo na overloadin yung turbo charger. Ito tayo ngayon sa turbo charger, sa turbine side. No? Bago lang, pinag-usapan natin yung compressor side, ngayon dito naman tayo sa turbine side. Ang turbine side ay meron din siya palang side glass na dapat nalagyan nyo ng oil. Kasi, ang turbo charger ay merong mga parts like liberant, seal, boosting, no? kasamang stop ring, ganoon din ang turbine shock. Kaya kailangan ng lubrication pag siya ay tumatakbo. Sa loob nito ay merong turbo charger, no? blades. Or... So in this side, this is what we call the turbine side of the turbo charger of the auxiliary engine. So, this is what we call the turbine side housing. The inside part, what we call the turbine shop. Diffuser contains also of the tow ring, the snap ring, as well the ceiling ring. So, the principles of this exhaust gas in two-stroke two cycle engine, even the four-stroke cycle engine, is if you remember the cycle that is what called the series of cycle in the events during suction compression and power after that the exhaust stroke so ano naman ang purpose ito ng temperature no? ito ay tawag na pyrometer yan ay indication kung malaman nyo kung ang inyong exhaust gases sa turbine side ay napakarumi na maliban dito merong dito na temperature sa individual sa ating exhaust gases cylinder na indication ng exhaust gases nyo ay napakarumi. Ibig sabihin dapat linisin nyo na ang inyong exhaust valve. Okay, nandito naman tayo ngayon sa ating parts ng turbo charger na, dis na disassembled. So, sa pinaliwanag ko, ito ay compressor housing at meron siya na 
leather gates at saka mayroong filter no ang purpose niya para masala ang dumi sa loob ng engine room pagkatapos niyan ang dumi mismo ay napipilter ng no sa ating filter sa pupunta ngayon ng hangin no dadaloy siya sa ito nakita niyo umiikot no dito ay dadaloy no ang hangin para ikutin ito ng compressor blades dadalhin sa intercooler tapos pupunta siya sa intake manifold at magkikita sa doon ng fuel para magkaroon ng power so sa binanggit na nang ito'y nabuksan natin pag once na pinaikot mo to ay matigas ibig sabihin hindi mo pa na kaya pandarin yung makina mo pero pag ito'y tumakbo na magag yung mabuti ibig sabihin ay garantisadong anda so ano naman ang tour inside no? dito sa side natin makita nyo no nakita nyo dito ay umiikot din Halimbawa, itong compressor side sa turbine side, mayroong different ring, no? Tawag na what we call is another name of B-ring, no? Pero yan ay nilubricate ng room oil at iniipit ng busing, slip at saka stamp ring. So, sa bilanggit mo na, kung gaano kabilis itong ating makina ng turbocharger mabilis niya pinapalabas yung dumi sa paas. So, dapat ano ba ang regular maintenance ito? Dapat na linisin nyo ang filter lagi ng inyong turbocharger at itong ating turbocharger ay may natatawag na turbo wash cleaning para hindi magkaroon ng carbon sa ating mga turbine side well. Okay, we are here now in our Virgin model of the auxiliary engine. This is also the type of turbocharger and the four stroke cycle engine. You can notice this is what we call the compressor housing fitted with the screen filter. So, I remind the air introduced going to the compressor. So there is also what we call the level gauge of the turbocharger. You have to maintain its maintaining level by opening this plug and supplying the lube oil system, the specified lube oil, and be sure that the engine and stop condition. So on the other side, this is what we call the compressor blades or compressor wheel fitted with its shaft. The internal part of this compressor, there is what we call the lever and float bearing and also contains of shaft, snap ring, as well the bosing. So if you can notice here, this is what we call the part of the compressor. It is considered the compressor diffuser. So after the air will introduce going here to the compressor side, as I mentioned before, that the air will leads or going to the air cooler. After that, proceeding to the intake manifold together with the fuel oil and will introduce ignition, combustion inside the combustion chamber and will create power. So in this side, this is what we call the turbine shop. The turbine to the turbocharger, or I mean the turbo, the turbine blades contains also shop, contains labyrinth, flow ring, boosting, sleeve, as well the snap ring. So, there is what we call also the turbine diffuser. So, the purpose of this turbocharger exhaust gas during exhaust stroke, the exhaust gases or the carbon dioxide will expel going to the incending of our vessel. So, take note. Before 
Cheque of this kind of what we call the turbocharger, the engine, also the oiler, as well the engine can be must familiarize regarding about the instruction manual, regarding about the operation, the starting and the stopping of the auxiliary engine, as well the proper maintenance based on the PMS. So what is the we call the PMS? The PMS is the plan maintenance system. So who is in charge of this kind of machinery is one of the critical machinery on board ship, a turbocharger. Naturally, the chip engineer is again is the overall in charge, but the engineer in charge of this machinery is the third engineer in the top domestic vessel or the second assistant engineer and the international vessel. Sa sunod nating pag-aralan, hindi lang pala mm. isang daylan na umuusok sa insidiriya. Ang isang daylan na nagkaroon ng problema ay itong tinatawag na fuel oil valve. Hindi na proper calibration, proper optimization, proper distribution of fuel oil inside the combustion mm. chamber with the proper maintenance based on the PMS, pwede pala na umusok ang no, sa taas ng insidin niya. So, makara no, pinag-aralan natin kung paano mag-calibrate ng ating fuel oil valve. Okay? Uh, once again, this is Chief Engineer Larry Gubatayo. Thank you very much for watching my video and saying you prevention is better than cure. Thank you very much.